in every business I've ever owned and run, every single time I've created wealth for myself, there's one principle that has proven true every single time. It's kind of obvious, but there's a part to it that's not. So the principle is, if money is my most important thing, then it will actually keep money out. If I want money more than anything else, then I'm actually gonna keep it out. People are gonna feel that, it's not gonna work very well. So people know that, right? That's the obvious part, kind of obvious to most people, hopefully. And so then, then, then this, the, what you do, the how then, is well, I have to make money not as important. So I have to make myself not want money and not need money. And I have to tell myself well, I don't need it, or I have to tell myself that it's not the most important thing. And that's great. That's just like trying to do this. Now, do not think of the pink elephant. Stop it. Don't, don't think of a pink elephant. No, I said, I said don't. Okay. It doesn't really work too well. So what do you do? What do you do? You get the principle and you want to not do it, but what do you do? Well, it's simple, but not as obvious. Figure out what you care about more. What do you care about more than money? What's more important to you than money? And here's the real test. What are you willing to sacrifice money for? And I would say go specifically within the context of the service or the product that you're providing within your business. What are you willing to give up money for? For example, in my current business, there's a, there's a lot of things that I'm not willing to take money for. I'm not willing to spend my time doing all sorts of marketing strategy and that kind of thing. I'm not willing to do anything that would get somebody to give me money, which isn't true for me. I'm not willing to deceive anybody. I'm not willing to do things that I don't enjoy to create money. That's a big one. How many people are not willing to do things they don't enjoy to create money? That sounds like, well, geez, I'm taking like a lot of things off the table right there. I'm idealistic and I stand for those ideals and I use that as a means of creating. Because here's the thing, the more things that you're willing to not do for money, this is the crazy paradox, the more your state of being becomes powerful because the more you stand for. The more you stand for as not willing to do for money, the more powerful your state of being becomes. The more you're willing to stand for something in life the more certainty people have that they can trust you because you're not moving, you're not bendable. Or maybe you're bendable in that you're flexible, but you're not gonna move, you're not gonna be uprooted. They're not gonna knock you down. And that creates an incredible amount of trust and certainty. And that trust and certainty is the conduit along which money moves. Money flows along conduits of certainty in the direction of power. So if you want money, create certainty and bring your power up. And the real simple way you can do that is decide what you care about more than money and be willing to give up money for that. The more things you have in that bucket and the more you stand for that, especially within the context of your business, the more money will move towards you. It's one of the most beautiful and profitable paradoxes I know. So know what you care about more than money and watch the money come in. I love you for listening and I'll talk to you soon.